Here are the latest COVID-19 numbers. North Dakota is reporting 447 new cases in the state, along with eight new deaths. Overall, 246 people have died in the state. Minnesota reports 689 new cases, along with 16 new deaths. 2,036 people have died in the state. In the coming days, you can expect a push to get you to wear a mask. The idea is surfacing today during a COVID-19 update in the FM area. Valley News Team's Callie Hubbard is live in the studio with details on the mask campaign. Callie? Andrew and Mike, a mask campaign could be the task force's attempt to get people to voluntarily get them and get feedback before there's any reconsideration of a mandate in Fargo. The local push to get you to cover up will go along with the statewide Mask Up North Dakota campaign. Fargo Mayor Tim Mahoney says the Red River Task Force will be working with local athletic teams, health systems, and you to better understand why they say masking up is so important. As we have heard from our public health professionals and healthcare systems, we need everybody to take this virus seriously. If not for your own health, please consider the health of your friends, family, neighbors, and our community's most vulnerable. Clay County Public Health says there's been a spike in cases this month in 18 to 22 year olds as they say people are not following CDC guidelines like before. Essentia and Sanford hospitals say they're seeing the highest level of COVID-19 patients since May. And on another matter, there's seeing some problems with contact tracers. The state's epidemiologist stressed the importance of being nice to them. He says that if you are asked questions about being exposed to COVID-19, you should tell the truth and cooperate. All right, thanks, Callie. To stay up to date on the upcoming mask campaign, download our VNL News app. Ford is recalling hundreds of thousands of vehicles. We'll tell you what it's for and what vehicles the recall applies to next on Valley News Live at 6.